Uh oh, that's my pager. I wonder who it is. Oh, it's the name equipment thing, because we took more than five minutes. Honestly, it's crazy how fast the weapon thing in this, is in this game. I'm like a little confused by how fast that happens. I'm good. I'm losing my like freaking all my priorities here. Like I needed to bring that gun to that phone guy, and now I need to get this purse to that lady. Oh boy, a designer, an Italian shoulder bag, maybe. Is this this handbag? There's nothing that's just purse. Like I know in my mind, a bag or handbag is uh, synonymous with a purse but like how do I know if the game's like no not a handbag a purse no oh, well I'll I'll bite the bullet I'll get the stupid French handbag it'll probably cost me an arm and a leg oh wow I got the crystal ball in my inventory that's funny hold on let me just see what okay so that's just to make money so we just got this crystal ball from an African marketplace I guess Maybe it's secret Wakandan tech. Maybe it's made from vibranium. Crystal vibranium. In any case, we're just, that's just to make some extra cash, I guess, from... from our adventures in the dragon and tiger. So, uh, let's, let's see what this baby gets us. Uh, whoa! Just a straight million. Sick! That basically financed that... Uh, Next expedition we did, that crystal ball right there. Cool. Okay, but now let's check the alley, I guess. This is so stupid. I guess I'll just walk in a random alley and find a forger there. Is this the alley that he meant? No? Guess this is the wrong alley. Weird. Oh, this alley, I guess. Wow. I, well, we found this this thingy here, right here. Hibiki Otsuki. Okie dokie. Okay, yeah, well... Well, I... Well, this is pretty alley-ish, too, I suppose. So I guess we'll take this as well. To find this forger person. Okay, you good to go. Now you talk forever on payphone for free. Great, thanks. See ya. Happy do business with you. Bye bye. What's that about? Some kind of deal went down. Probably best I don't get involved though. Oh. Huh? Oh, my card go all over. Guy dumped a bunch of phone cards. Fine, I guess I should lend him a hand. Oh, oh no! No touch the merchandise. <laughs> Oh, uh, man, I can't believe Majima's being this oblivious. I just can't believe this shit's happening on this, like, alley. Huh? I'm doing you a favor picking up your cards. I don't call for that attitude, friend. Ah, thank you. But uh, no look too closely. Why not? They're just phone cards, right? Or is there something different about them? Oh, no, no, no. No looking. Uh, no look, please. Huh? Wait, what's with these phone cards? They got a strip of tape over the phone punches holes. I'm getting the picture now. The bogus cards, huh? Huh? Uh -huh. Sorry, my hearing not good. What? I said these phone cards are bogus, aren't they? Oh my god. Uh huh. Japanese very hard to understand. Sorry, not get what you're saying. Huh? Seriously? The phone guards are bogus! Huh? Oh, oh no! Sorry, sorry! This is, yeah, this is how, this is how organized crime happens, guys. This is like 100% fact. Don't worry about it. <sighs> Nailed it. Oh no, 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 it's all over, oh no, oh no, it's all over for me, no. How about you just calm down? Oh no, I, I mean yes. Oh, p please, you not tell anyone, if anyone find out, very bad trouble. Huh? I know, we make deal, I pro-forger, 
I make one fake thing for you. You no tell anybody. Good deal for you. Appreciate the offer, but can't think of any fakes I'd want. What? We just... Did the game really intend that we didn't go to this right away, even though Majima's like, might as well check that alley, because this is more like you bump into this like way later, after picking up that quest, just to like, you know, do it later on. Hmm? Wait, there was that fella wanting a fake heart necklace for this gal. I can hook him up with this guy. Hey, I might have something for you to do. You got a minute? Of course. What kind of fake you want? Is it that easy? We just get it? So there you have it. Oh, it's just him explaining the the, 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 uh, the request. I think it was called Destiny. Can you make a heart necklace for that fella? Piece of easy cake. I take care of it, no problem. Top quality forgery I make for you. Okay, you give young man this. My business card. You got fan. Is it, is it fun or is it just like a fan? Fan's business card. Tell your friend come to my office. I tell workers so they look after him. My name Fan San. Nice meet you. It is Fan. Okay. My name's Majima. I'm counting on you then. Okay, but you no forget. No talking about my telephone card anywhere, please. Triad boss prefer dead forger to famous forger, you know? Is that right? Forging stuff is a tough gig. Okay, okay. Your secret's safe with me. Okay, I go back to office now. <laughs> well, I'll be. I found a forger. I'll give his business card to that blubbering fool. He was out in front of that fancy boutique store. Oh, this is just turning up perfectly. We'll just take care of this. Ooh, look at this lovely. This is a really beautiful looking uh, front facade on this uh, place right here. But anyway, let's uh, get that cart to that guy, and should we, should we make a run to uh, the 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 telephone? Is there an exclamation point there, per chance? No, there isn't. I guess I, I guess the model gun I bought isn't gonna do for that guy. Whoa! Check this. This beautiful car here at the Maharaja. Nah, we're not doing disco. It's not nighttime. There's no disco fever. It's not at all that I'm intimidated by how, like, tricky that disco minigame was. <laughs> oh, what am I gonna do? Still no closer to a solution, huh? Oh no, no luck at all. I suppose you couldn't get any leads on a forger either. <laughs> yeah, take this business card and go to the address on it. It's an office. You handed over Fawn's business card. Huh? huh? What is this? There's a forger there. Show him the card, tell him you know me, and he ought to make you a top quality fake of your heart necklace. You... you're not pulling my leg, are you? I knew you were someone special the moment I saw you. <laughs> nah, ain't nobody special. Just got lucky. Um, may I ask your name? Majima. Thank you very much, Majima-san. I'm sorry, but I'm running out of time. I'll go see him right away. You do that. Yes, remember, forgers work on the wrong side of the law. You mind your manners or you might get hurt. Hi. I will! Thank you again! Hmm. Fansan the forger seemed like a good sport. That fella's just a normal guy. Who knows what could go wrong? Maybe I'll check in on him when I got a minute. Yeah, the quest did not end. Should I run? I'm right there. I guess I'll go check on them real quick, like, just to make sure nothing bad happens. The fact that the quest didn't end is certainly no cause for alarm, yes? Yeah? Huh? Oh no. We'll, we'll go by. Where was my, uh... Oh, there's sunshine. I'm like, I'm kind of in the neighborhood. Should I go do some cabaret in the meanwhile? But I'm, I'm not... Let, let's not do that now. It's... Too much off the beaten path as it is. Well, not really. It's right there, but like we're doing got so much going down right now, I'd rather not do that at the moment. Fansan the Forger's office was around here somewhere. Someone please help! 
What was that? Sounds like Lover Boy's in trouble. Uh oh. Holy cow! Oh, please let me go. I. Wh why did we end up doing Russian roulette knife style here? Cannot do. You tell me real reason why you come here. Wrong answer. Finger go bye bye. Please stop! I'm not lying. I really only want a necklace. I was given that card and told to come here. Cannot be true. This place top secret. Normal necklace buyer cannot find. B -b but I'm telling you the truth. Help! Looks like things went sideways. Good. Hey, he's done nothing wrong. Let him go, will ya? What? Majima-san! Hmm? Who are you? Ah, you are partner of this guy. This place top secret. You know secret, you know stay alive. Sorry, you have to die. Hold on, one of your guys told me about this office. No one here sell out, no traitor here. You dishonor us. You die now. Okay, you could certainly try that. You and your collection of weapons. Let's see if I can catch a couple of... Look at that AI on those two guys. They're like, ooh, maybe I should back off from this dude. Finish him off. And then we grab his sword. Oh, no, we don't have the sword available. That's annoying. Ooh. What, what do we do with this chair, though? Ooh. Ooh. Well, that wasn't all that exciting, I suppose. There we go. Let's... Finish off with some dance battling. Oh, that's cool that they actually gave them Chinese names, these dudes. Yang and Ma, and I wonder... You see what the other guy's name was, but... Uh... Oh, yeah. There we go. Got him. I forgot to do the dance battler, the grapple thing again. It's fine. Go. How come so strong? If you just give me a chance to explain myself... <laughs> What's going on here? Boys, what happened? Eh, uh, boss! What happened here? Explain. Boss, these guys, they say someone to tell them about office. They just come in here. Huh? These guys? Oh. Boss, no one tells secret office location. We don't tell anyone, never. These guys lying. Uh, hey, old guy, can you explain? Fans and forget to tell boys here you coming. Oh, come on. <laughs> what a wacky misunderstanding. And freaking lover boy is just like, I nearly lost my finger. So then I give business card. Oh, that's what happened. Very sorry, Majima-san. Yeah. Nothing to forgive. <laughs> ah, very good. Everyone old friend. Happy ending. Good, good, good. Says the guy who shit the bed in the first place. Aw, oh, shit the bed. So we make copy of Destiny Heart Necklace, that all? Uh. Yeah, can you do it? No problem. We copy weapons. Harder things. Necklace is easy. No worry, we do good job. Top quality. <laughs> good news, eh? Thank you so much. Okay, we make right away. Now watch us work, though. You go outside a little, okay? Alright. Well, that went all well in the end. I suppose. Okay, it's finished. Excellent quality. Well, well. This is damn good work. Wow, it's exactly like the real thing. I'm sure my girlfriend will be delighted. Okay, here you go. Now promise to Majima-san is done. <laughs> yep, the square. Phew, what a huge relief. Thanks to everyone's help, I can fulfill my promise to my girlfriend. I made it just in time for her birthday. Good. Get going, then. Hi. Yes, I better get moving. Thank you so much again.
Yes, that ought to do it, then. Still, that necklace. Necklace. Still, that necklace. Even a woman's not gonna know it's a fake? No problem. I'm sure no one can tell it's not real. Secret safe forever. Okay. Hope you're right. Fonson says it's okay, but he blows smoke, too. Guess I ought to see how this plays out. I'll be on my way, too. Thanks. Oh, no, no problem. Thank you to you. Okay, bye-bye, Majima-san. The quest is still not over, so... Hmm. Oh, never mind. We just cut straight to it. Okay. Oh, there's a lover boy. Is he really gonna get away with passing a fake necklace to his gal? Happy birthday! Here's your present. Like I promised, it's a heart necklace from Destiny. Wow! Really? I can't believe it! It's so adorable! It's crazy popular now, though. It must have been hard to get. Thank you so much! I love that she's called the girlfriend. That's like, <laughs> the the part of the plot is she's the girlfriend. Uh, yeah. It was a real challenge to get. <laughs> I have to admit I was worried. Stores can't keep it in stock, so I wasn't sure you'd be able to get it. Well, you know, I, I spent a night standing in line, kind of. You spent a whole night in line? You did all that for me? I uh, didn't, but... Well, yeah, something like that. Really? I'm so happy. I'm tearing up now. Thank you. I love you so much. Th th that, that's good. I'm glad it makes you so happy. <laughs> well, that went okay. How about that? Looks like he got away with the fake. Huh? <laughs> huh? Is something wrong? Huh? Oh man, that's the face of a moral dilemma. Sorry. Huh? Why are you apologizing? I have to tell you what really happened. Huh? Whoa, whoa! Don't tell me he's gonna... That necklace, it's actually... It's actually... It's a fake. Pardon? It's fake? I'm sorry. Wh why? Why did you try to trick me? That's terrible. I'm so sorry. You gave me a fake for my birthday? I feel like an idiot for being so happy. Yep, now it's all going to hell in a handbasket. This calls for the Majima touch. Oh my god, Majima's just gonna step in and be some kind of wacky bro. Excuse me, lady. Pardon? Majima-san! What on earth possessed you to spill the beans, huh? Because when I saw Sa how happy it made her, I couldn't help but feel this horrible guilt. Hey, in for a yen, in for a kilo. I get... That. Yeah, I guess that works. If you were gonna get a guilt complex, you shouldn't have faked it to begin with. I know. I'm sorry. I'm the worst. <sighs> Okay, lady, let me clue you in on this, though. That necklace is fake, and your boyfriend's a dingbat. Can't fault you for being upset. But he wanted to see you happy. That part is real. Huh? He went through a lot to get that fake. The kind of trouble you probably don't want to know about. He ended up in a forger's secret office with his life and his digits in danger. Yeah, he's an idiot, all right. Sure, trying to slip you a fake's a dumb mistake. But he went through all that just so he could see a smile. That desire. That part of it, at least. Ain't nothing fake about it. <laughs> a rapid stare. You really went through all that? Uh. Yeah. I'm sorry. You idiot! Huh? How could you be so stupid? What if something happened to you? What am I supposed to do then? Sorry. How does a guy who's missing fingers hold his girlfriend's hand? Uh... 
Please, no more lies. Just be honest with me. Y yes I'm really, really sorry. Next time when the real thing is in stock, we'll go buy one together. I don't want it. Huh? huh? I don't want another one. I have this one. But that one's just a fake. It's... it's real enough for me. And that makes it unique. Listen to what she's saying. She's telling her the fake that her boyfriend struggled to get shines brighter than the real thing. She's a fine lady, you fool. You best be good to her. Hi. Yes, yes I will. Majima-san, thank you so much for everything you did for me. For us. Please, I want you to have this. A secret wallet? From now on, I'll always be honest with my girl. No more faking, only what I really feel. Yeah, that's for the best. Hi. Yes, thank you so much. Shall we go? Yep. Hey, that was incredibly sappy, but rewarding, I guess. A fake that shines brighter than the real thing, huh? Heh. <laughs> Stay happy, you two. Well, I sounded like a stable relationship in the end, so I guess it's good. Okay, what do we got here? We got the security wallet. Oh, I already had, like, this thing to pro pro protect me from shakedowns. What's this do? Raises your financial luck slightly, and when shaking down, you can stash money inside, reducing the amount taken from you. Okay, so it's kind of like this one, plus... plus more money made. Um, So this says it raises the amount drastically, so I guess I save more money if I lose the shakedown. But since I know I'm not gonna lose anymore, <laughs> I guess I can put this on. It's got less stats, though. That's a little annoying as well. But, like, I, I, I'm, I'm greedy for money, so I guess I'll hold on to that. What's my money status? No, it's only six million. I need... I need more! More money! Unless I've... Yeah, I, I think I checked this last time. I've exhausted all the cheap tiers. So it is 15 milli next for me, basically. It's just the way it's gonna go, I think. I think so, yeah. Why am I looking at the slugger style? That that's not that's nothing for me. It's the thug style one I want. Yeah, 15 milli, that's gonna be the next step. We had to have more health. That'll that'll at least help out to some degree. Oh, that's cool, that's a cool move. Damn. There's so many cool moves, but I'm just like, you know, I'm laser targeting on those uh, unique ones, so... Eh. We got a little bit of episode time. I don't think we're gonna have time for the main quest after all. We got so sidetracked by all this silliness. But, um... But, uh, we'll, uh, we'll, 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 we'll finish up some of this stuff, and next time we'll do the main quest when we open up the episode. We'll see what the time is as we wrap up. A purse would be nice. If you can buy me a designer player named Perth, I'll work for you. Hey, I got something I can give her. What am I gonna hand over? Yes, the handbag works. Here you go. What do you think? Oh, wow, this is very nice. Sure, I'll work at your club. I'm Harumi. Thanks. Cool. A silver hostess. Bueno. All right, I recruited a new girl. You got some pretty good girls in our lineup now. I'm gonna have to up my club management here. Uh, should I end the episode with a run at the club? Mm, but it, it takes so much time to prep, though. Oh, I'd have to do y Yuki's quest again. I don't think we're gonna do that at the end of this episode. I think we'll just set up a new dragon and tiger run. Track down the location of a dangerous insurgent cabal. Encountered a shady individual. He beckoned me to follow him. Yes, this way to the revolution. Twins or clones? Negotiation partners doppelganger appears. Oh my god, is this Fei Hu's dudes? Resounding success. Yes, they heard that I know Fei Hu. Mission went even better than hoped. We got wooden collie sticks and double slats. I don't know what double slats are, but... You'll come again soon. Let's check what double slats do. Uh, it's not here, that's for sure. Equipment? Uh, 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 double slats. 
But they're not actually weapons, they can be used as Kali sticks to bust heads nicely. Oh, that's like low tier Kali sticks. I, I feel ya. Makes sense to me. What is this? Oh, that's the blackjack I got. Cool. I have to give that a go at some point too. Ah, so many fun items. Alright. Let's set up a new agent. Let's sell that lumber I have first. It's all nicely used, and I don't want this... I guess this model gun won't work. I guess I never did test. I could have gone to that telephone booth, but... Eh. I'm, I'm, I'm being dumb right now. We'll see if we get like a real gun from one of these equipment searches, and I'll, I'll try that then. It's, it's an automatic gun that the phone guy asked. I don't, I don't know if I would want to do that quest. It seems like such a hassle. Okay, baby, what's next on there, our itinerary? So we did the Liberation Army camp. After that, I want to go to... Ooh, we're going to South America, I think. Yeah, we're going to South America, baby. We're going to the... Uh... Going to the jungle. We're going to the... Uh... Is there any other jungle in, in South America except for the Amazon? I, actually, yeah. Is the rainforest in, like, the north called different than the Amazon? Or, like, maybe in, like, Colombia, like, behind the Andes? I never actually thought about that. Or is it all just called the Amazon? Huh. With piranhas in the rivers and huge snakes in the forest, it's a holiday spot only for the most adventurous. All right. Well, we don't get crazy stuff there. We get knuckles, a decorative, and an amulet. Yeah, that amulet could be exciting. So who do we send into the jungle? A professional wrestler. <laughs> Sounds crazy. A con artist. A samba dancer. Traveling cellists. I don't know. I don't know any about these. Oh, I want to send a professional wrestler. Oh, man. Do I know any Brazilian wrestlers? Oh, jeez. I have to actually think about this. Because I, I, uh, I had my man William Regal when I sent that op in England, but... Uh, who could be South how South American? Um, hmm. Oh, isn't there a guy in Chikara right now called Bullet Ant? Like, there, there's so many ant-themed wrestlers in, uh, in uh, Chikara. Because they love those ants. I love those ants. I, I can send Bullet Ant down there. I, you know, he, I, I'm gonna assume he's from down there. Well, actually, now that I think about it, speaking of really obscure wrestling, there is a Finnish wrestling league. Wrestling trivia here for you guys. There is a Finnish wrestling league called uh, Fight Club Finland, I think. I've seen... I've actually seen them. I, I, I've seen real-life wrestling. They, they, for some reason, they've done a couple of wrestling shows at the uh, Ren Fair. Uh, well, the, not the Ren Fair, the Medieval Fair um, here in Finland. So I've actually had the luck of seeing uh, some Finnish brand wrestling. That, that, was, that was good fun. I haven't seen this guy, though. There is a guy called Ocelot in... Uh, the Finnish League, and he's a mask wrestler who has an Ocelot mask. I mean the actual cat, not the, not the, uh, not the, um, the Metal Gear guy. I just remember because his bio on the page was like, he showed up in a cargo crate from a ship that came from South America to Finland, and here he is wrestling in Finland. Oh man, I love wrestling gimmicks. Let's send that Ocelot guy in. Okay, I'll, okay, I'll be straight. That was like, over five years ago, and knowing the turnout with wrestlers, he might not be there anymore. I don't know, I guess the Finnish wrestling scene is so small, I don't know if they can... they can change their roster up that much, but... Uh, okay, you crazy birds, let's uh, put in another... Let's put another milli on this, while I send Ocelot in to get me some stuff. Just put him in back on the boat to see his homeland, and then he'll come to Japan? Uh -huh. Japan's big on pro wrestling. I'm sure. I'm sure even Finnish wrestlers have been there at some point. I know no one there at home cares about Finnish wrestling trivia, but I do. So there you go. Okay, next episode, it's happening, you guys. We are gonna go check up leads on the guy who, on Japanese vamp who kidnapped, kidnapped, saved, absconded with Makoto. And we'll carry on with that. So look forward to that next time, guys. Goodbye!